everyone. I just um, discovered a depository book on my porch today. Um, I'm pretty certain I know what it is, but I just thought I would do a quick unboxing. I'm not sure how well this is going to go one-handed. Um, just because, well, yeah, I'm one-handed. But I just thought I would do a bit of a quick unboxing of this and show you what I think it is. Um, I think it's Midnight Sun by Stephanie Meyer. And let's see if we can get it open. One hand. This is going to be awkward. Can we do it one handed with this? But I just thought I um, might as well unbox it on camera and share it all with you. Sorry, I'm just going to pin the box there with my knee. Did it all in one strip. <laughs> so yeah, I just thought I would um see what it was. And I was right, it is Stephanie Meyer. I've only got the paperback versions of this, but I got the hardback version of Afterlife or whichever it was for um book depository, shall we say. But I wanted to get Midnight Sun and see Edward's version because I own the Twilight DVDs and the Twilight um, well, movies and the books and blah, blah, blah. It comes with our usual depository bookmark. And the rest is just stuff um, to get rid of. But yeah. So I just thought I would do a bit of an unboxing of Midnight Sun by Stephanie Meyer. And... I love that pomegranate detail. So let's look at it. Now just quickly, bear with me. I'm sort of trying to do things here. Um, I just need to shift my crutches quickly. Uh, excuse me. I just want to see if I can work out there it is, it's on this shelf here, so. Um, as you can see, a lot of my shelves are double rowed, and I've got an excess of book depository bookmarks. <laughs> Way excess of book bookmarks, and I just dropped a whole heap on the floor that I'm going to have to pick up. Fun, 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 fun. Oh no, yeah, there it is. Okay, I was right. So, um, all the other editions I've actually got in paperback just because, well, we got the paperback editions when I was a kid, but now I like to, I prefer to buy hardbacks if I can. And yeah, I've got way too many bookmarks. <laughs> too many. I guess I've been buying too many books. But this is just a view of what my shelves are like with how stacked up I am with books. It's all double stacked this shelf. So yeah. Bear with me. We'll shift those and I'll have to work out getting them back in. Um, I don't know where my Twilight editions are but my Twilight editions are just the paperback editions, not hardcover editions. So um this was the edition of the first Twilight book, I think, um, along with Life and Death, the classic reimagining novel it mentions, and why she's changed things, and um, Bella is Bo in this one, from what I know. And, yeah, um, obviously really happy to have it, so it's obviously first book in it and then um, Twilight Reimagined and so on the front here you've got the original special 10th anniversary edition of Twilight and that's the original Twilight so I'm um, sort of I don't know if I'll eventually get the rest of the Twilight books in the hardcover I don't know we'll wait and see but I got this from my original Dimix but yeah, I guess something to consider later on, but I'm not sure if I will get the original Twilight 
um, books in the hardcover set because I've already got them in paperback and read them as a kid but I just thought I would show you that I've got that one I'm so happy that the size sort of matches <laughs> but yeah I love my Twilight books and the movies and stuff I watch them again every now and then for enjoyment purposes but yeah so we got Midnight Sun by Stephanie Meyer see what does the inside look like a couple of little dints but not too bad but very happy to have it and I'm looking forward to reading this sometime so our description says I could see how easy it would be to fall into loving Bella it would be exactly like falling effortless not letting myself love her was the opposite of falling it was pulling myself up a cliff face hand over hand the task is grueling as if I had no more than mortal strength. When Edward Cullen and Bella Swan meet in Twilight, an iconic love story was born. But until now, fans have heard only Bella's side of the story. At last, readers can experience Edward's version in the long-awaited companion novel Midnight Sun. This unforgettable tale, as told through Edward's eyes, takes on a new and decidedly dark twist. Meeting Bella is both the most unnerving and intriguing event he has experienced in all his years as a vampire. As we learn more fascinating details about Edward's past and the complexity of his inner thoughts, we understand why this is a, the defining struggle of his life. How can he justify following his heart if it means leading Bella into danger? In Midnight Sun, Stephanie Meyer transports us back to the world that has captivated millions of readers and brings us an epic novel about the profound pleasures and devastating consequences of immortal love. So I'm so excited to have this. It's not a signed edition or anything, but it is a first edition. We've got our chapter. And I think from what I know, this is just um, the single book about Edward kind of thing. Um, and his side of the story. So, yeah, I'm very excited to have this. I just thought I would do a bit of an unboxing. Um, I don't know where my original books are, but... Who knows, maybe I'll upgrade them to hardcover. I normally like to get hardcover these days, even though they cost a bit more in Australia just because of the fact that, um, should we say, the hardcover seems to last better and longer, and I just, I still buy paperbacks, but I just really love my hardcover books these days. <laughs> um, yeah, crazy book person. But yeah, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, please leave a like, subscribe, comment. I always love hearing from you. And I will see you later. And I'll probably do a book photo of this shortly to post up on my Instagram. But yeah, if you enjoyed this, please leave a like, subscribe, comment. I always love hearing from you. And I will talk to you later. Bye.